Okay, so welcome to question 27. Question 27 gives us this stress matrix, 60, 20, 0, 20, 90, 0, 0, 0, 0, and asks us to find two things, the principal stresses and the normal stress along an axis 30 degrees from the maximum principal stress towards the minimum principal stress. So a rotation about the medium principal stress, if you like. So uh, we can notice it's a 2 by 2 stress matrix, so we can just do a mirror circle. We don't need to do eigenvalues and eigenvectors. So we can take um, a Mohr's circle as follows um, between 90, 20 and 60, 20. Uh, that's my tor axis, that's my sigma axis. I draw my circle. My center is going to be at 75. Um, and I've got a uh, triangle there. That's 15, that's 20. Oh, surprise, it's a 3, 4, 5 triangle again. So that's 25 um, for the radius. So the principal stresses are 95, 75 plus 20, and 55. So the principal stresses are uh, 95, 55, and 0 megapascals. Okay. Um, uh, have I added 25 correctly? No. 25 plus 75 is 100. And 75 minus 25 is 50. Don't going a little bit too fast. So 150 and 0. So lesson in life, don't go too fast. Um, and uh, now we want to do a rotation of 30 degrees from the maximum principal stress, which is that one, towards the minimum principal stress, which is that one. So previously, if this was these axes were x, y, z, this Mohr's circle was a rotation about z. It's a rotation of that angle to theta about z. Uh, so I should draw my arrow the other way around, really. Now, um, x, y, z there, of course, as well. Now, this is going to be a rotation. So this is now x prime, y prime, z prime, which is the same as z. So this is going to be a rotation around x, z, so around y prime. So this is a rotation around y prime of a Mohr's circle between this principal stress state, which is 100 and naught. So we've got a 150 naught is our new principal stress state. And we're going to, have to do a rotation about y, so around that 100 naught, naught, naught that stress matrix. So we've got a Mohr's circle which goes 100, 0. There's our circle. Centers at 50. Radius is 50. And we're doing a rotation of 30 degrees from the maximum towards the minimum. So it's a rotation that way. And it's 60 degrees that way. And that's going to give us um, our new stress state being those coordinates. So now we've got to find out uh, this is going to be cos 60, that's going to be sine 60. So our new stress state is going to be our 50, 0, 0, 0 stays the same. And this one is, uh, this guy here, is 50 plus cos 60. The shear is sine 60, the shear is sine 60. And this one is 50 minus sine 60. And we want the normal to that one, so we want this number, um, which is 50 plus, um, oh, sorry, 50 cos 60, 50 sine 60. I need to put my 50 in there, 50. So my normal stress, my answer is that my normal stress on the requested axis axis is 
50 times 1 plus cos 60 degrees. Um, and cos 60 is a half, so that's 75 megapascals. And that's the solution to question 27. OK, so just as an addendum to question 27, um, we did a rotation uh, around the middle principal stress axis between the 100 and the 0, the maximum and the minimum. And that gave us this Mohr circle. So there's 100, there's 0. Uh, it's, there's no shears because it's the principal stress matrix or tensor. There's Mohr circle. The center's at 50. And therefore, this amount is cos, uh, cos 60 times 50 because the radius is 50. Um, so the uh, stress is here. The normal stress is 50 plus 50 cos 60. And this one's 50 minus 50 cos 60. And because we're in... We've rotated anti-clockwise that way because we're in this quadrant, that one and that one. The shears we said were negative was the convention. If we'd rotated the other way, the shears would have been positive. And actually, the question doesn't state which it is. So, if it, so as drawn, uh, it, these would be negative shear stress, which I didn't have a moment ago. But if I had put it the other way, uh, they would have been positive. So actually, there's a slight ambiguity in the question. Um, depends which way you rotate from which one axis to the other. Um, so that's the last thing to say about question 27.